Hey guys, so today I am doing a review for you and I want to apologize in advance for my voice because I am really sick right now and but I wanted to film this so bad because I have been waiting for this to come in the mail for such a long time and I am just absolutely stoked to review this for you guys and like, please ignore the makeup wipes in the background. Um, it's for mascara and so I was like wiping off my mascara before I filmed the video. Anyways, there is a company um, out there called Influencer, and it's actually less of a company, more of a website that focuses on reviews for products. And so it is a community of bloggers, YouTubers, and just people that review everything from makeup, skincare, um, tech stuff, fitness, food, just all sorts of categories. And they go on there and they can review these products, share them with people. Um, and they have, you know, their links to their social media sites where you can kind of go on there. And so if you're curious about a product, more than likely you'll find a thousand reviews for it on this website. And so they also have a program which is called the Voxbox program, which you can sign up for. And some of the people that are, I guess, considered like the more VIP or whatever people that unlock badges on the website, which is basically you have to... Um, you get a certain criteria, you unlock the badge, and then if you unlock the badge, you will be sent surveys or pre-surveys to see if you qualify for being sent one of these Vox boxes. And I've done quite a few of them, and I haven't been accepted for any of them until now, and I didn't even know that I was accepted for this one until they sent me the email, and they're like, congrats, you're being sent a box. And I was like, eh. And of all the boxes they could have sent me, this one is the most perfect ever, and I'm so excited. So... I do have to mention um, a few things before I talk about the product. Um, you aren't paid, and I'm not paid for this product, and so this isn't where they sent me money and they're like, review my stuff. And um, I'm not sponsored or anything, so this isn't a sponsored video. They just, they ask that when they send you their product, they're like, hey, tell us what you think, you know, and then go on the website and let other people know what you think as well. And so... I could like this, I could not like it. I'm not being sponsored to say, I like this product. I may not, we don't know. But I do have to let you know, it was sent to me as a complimentary gift for review. And so I just wanted to mention that, and all of the info will be linked in the bottom bar below. And so I got the box and I was really worried because the box itself was a little bit damaged. It's a little bit worse for wear, but it has the, the YSL logo on the side there and it has influenced on the actual box. And then you open it up and it just has the black paper that's in there. And then it has this little card um, that kind of shows the um, some of the YSL products here. And then on the back of the card, it gives you the steps for how you are supposed to go on the website. And you're supposed to log into your profile, check in your box. You're like, hey, I got the box. And then share it and review it. And so you can do a blog post. You can do Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. YouTube, you know, everything. And so I am doing my YouTube video because I want to show you guys what this product looks like. And I'm going to go ahead and apply it so you guys can see it. I have, I opened the box just now, but I haven't actually opened up anything else. So this is what the actual package of the mascara looks like. And I adore, it's lucky that I already adore YSL products. And so I only have one that I have owned personally. I've tried samples of others. But I own the YSL lipstick, which my boyfriend bought me, and it's amazing. So I'm really hoping that this is good, and I'm glad that they sent me a mascara of all things because I'm really, really picky when it comes to mascara because my eyelashes are not the most fantastic, and so I have high expectations. And this being YSL, I have even higher expectations, so we'll see. But this is called the um, Luxurious Mascara for a False Lash Effect. Now, I've been into lately trying mascaras that are supposed to do that, and some of the ones I've tried have not had that claim. And so this is just number one, high-density black. Um, the packaging, I mean, I could obsess about the packaging forever. And one of the claims on here, it says, improved formula does not dry out. Um, and it's just, it's gorgeous, gorgeous packaging. And so the package inside looks like this, and oh my gosh, I mean, that's just, it's stunning. That's a mascara. It's just, it's beautiful. And it feels really um, like it has good quality to it. Like it's a nice metal tube and it doesn't feel like it's, you know, at all cheap. And, you know, it wouldn't be for YSL. And so I have like the worst allergies. That's what I meant by being sick right now. And so I'm hoping that that does not get in the way of me trying this. But we're going to go ahead and do it anyway. So I'm going to open it up and see what the brush looks like. Oh, and it's a nice brush. I like 
these kind of brushes versus the um like the rubberized ones i don't like rubberized brushes for my own lashes but the brush looks really awesome and so i'm gonna go ahead and i'm just going to apply this so that we can kind of see how it works because i'm so excited and so i have my little mirror here off to the side and so i'm gonna go ahead and apply it on this side and then to this eye and let's see if this stuff is amazing i just i'm so excited so So far, the application is not bad. And this side is my trouble side, and so if it, this mascara can make this side of my lashes look anything other than just pathetic, then that's awesome. And so, I'm going to get uncomfortably close to the camera because I want you guys to see that. That's amazing. Look how long those look. Awesome. So, let's go ahead and apply a coat to the other side. I'm going to have my mirror here so it might be obnoxious for a second. And this is my better side, so usually this side looks better than the other one. And if my eyes or nose or anything seems a little red, it's because I just I have a tack of the allergies right now. And I'm allergic to allergy medicine, so... But... Wow. Now... I don't know about a false lash effect, but those are long. Like, holy freaking long, Batman. Look at that. That's amazing. That's just one coat. That's really nice. That's really pretty. Wow. This is beautiful. And again, I wasn't paid or sponsored or anything for this. I got some on my eye here. And so this is just my super honest, this is what I think opinion. So... First impression, amazing. I love this stuff. And I've used mostly in my life drugstore mascaras. And so I've never used a ton of high-end ones, except for like little teeny samples here and there. But I've never used YSL before. And so I'm gonna put on I'm putting on a second coat right now. And then I think I will wait a little bit for that to dry a little bit more before I put on a third coat. But so far, it's applying quite nicely. Let's go ahead and do this other side. And I'm not wearing any kind of eyeshadow or anything else too, so that you guys can really just see exactly the way the actual mascara looks without anything interfering. And so that is two coats. And for somebody who does not have at all impressive lashes, that's amazing. Look at that. It's gorgeous. Wow. So, that is super amazing. I'm so excited that this is good because there has been times where I've used other high-end mascaras um, that I have not liked at all. And so I just, and like I said, I'm so picky, but this one just, it looks awesome. And this has the same, if not better, kind of formulation and, um, <clears throat> uh, excuse me, as the that um, one I just reviewed the physician's formula except this has that effect with the fibers except it doesn't have fibers in it at all so this is not from what I can tell from the packaging this is not a fiber mascara but it really gives you the look as if you were using those little fibers which is perfect it's just absolutely perfect and it says the YSL legend just gets better luxurious mascara for a false lash effect now with a care-enriched formula, fresh day after day, instant dramatic volume, and ideal makeup result. So the volume is not like super crazy, like, you know, a voluminous mascara, but the length is crazy on this. And so now that this is dried for a sec, I'm going to apply just a third coat because I never do more than three coats of mascara. And so let's just kind of really amp this up. It does give decent volume, but the length is what's really kind of just wowing me right now. And after this third coat, it does get a little bit clumpy. Just a teensy bit, not too bad. If you play with it a little bit, it's okay, but... Man, it just this, it seems like they're getting longer and longer. Like, this is ridiculous. In a good way. <clears throat> I really wasn't going to film this because I was sick, but I was like, I have to. I'm so glad I am. Oh 
my god. Wow. So, this is the most amazing mascara I think I've ever used. I like it better for length than the Too Faced Better Than Sex. Like, this is really competing with that right now because the length on this is just amazing. I like the fluttery full effect that my Better Than Sex mascara gives me, but this stuff is just, it's so long. They look like I have lash extensions and that's just that's amazing so if you guys have a chance please and like I said again I'm not sponsored or anything to, to say this but you should check out just to see if you can get um, this mascara or any other of the Vox boxes go onto the influencer site and check it out and I'll link all of my stuff down below so you guys can check it out um, I'll have like a blog post and everything on there and I'll do some you know selfies or whatever so you guys can see but it really is amazing and I will also find out because I haven't looked yet to see if this is available on the website since they sent it to me for review I'm assuming it's already out but I'm not sure if it is but if it is out and it's in stores you guys seriously need to buy this it's probably gonna be a splurge I'm not sure what the price is gonna be usually why I sell stuff is pretty spendy I think the lipstick was like close to 40 after tax but it's just it's so worth it this is the most amazing mascara I think I've ever used and I'm not just saying that because it was sent to me I just I'm saying that because I'm really picky and after applying that and looking at this I just I can't stop looking at it it's just they look so long and that never happens with me so if you guys have a chance check it out I'll have all of the info in the info box it'll be a really long info box because I want to just cram it full of info for you guys but this is this is really cool stuff so um, check it out definitely and so I will see you guys next time bye